are here at the uh, Seven Islands Birding State Park on the banks of the French Broad River, just east of Knoxville. We're here in this shoal area. Uh, the reason we selected this area for searching for freshwater sponges is because of the, the rock habitat. And uh, freshwater sponges need a hard substrate on which to attach. And thus with the flowing water, the rock substrate, knowing that sponges are filter feeders and that they like to, the, the, the flowing current to bring food to them, this is an ideal spot. Most people are unaware of the existence of freshwater sponges. Of course, most people uh, are very well aware of marine sponges and, of course, SpongeBob SquarePants. But this is, this is a very unique animal. It's at the very bottom of the animal kingdom. If you were to look at the animal kingdom of life, you'd see a common ancestor with two branches. One branch goes over to the sponges, and the other branch goes to every other type of animal. So they are truly unique in the animal kingdom. There's no other animal like a freshwater sponge. Today was a very good day. Uh, once we got here, we picked up our first sponge within just, just a matter of a minute or two. Uh, had a great crew here today, some young, stu uh, young girls from uh, various schools, LMU and uh, Alabama at Huntsville, and uh, they got some experience uh, capturing and and, and studying that very elusive, secretive creature known as the freshwater sponge. And uh, I think we had a fun time. I haven't been in mud like this since I worked on a pig farm.